my name is Tracy, and I'm here with West Valley Music to speak to you about the trumpet. The first thing you need to do is get your instrument out of its case. It's very important that you open the case up correctly. Make sure that you find the top. If you look for the design or any kind of label, that's going to be on the top of the case. When you reach into the case, you want to get a hold of the valve casing on the instrument. And then go ahead and move it into your left hand. Your thumb will go on this side, and then all your other fingers fit into this space here. You can either put your ring finger or your pinky finger into the ring, and it is adjustable for your comfort. Then you want to get your mouthpiece and put it into the receiver and give it a slight twist. Your right hand sits on top with your fingers on the valves, and then you're ready to play. Some of the parts of the trumpet are the mouthpiece, the receiver, this is where you place the mouthpiece, the lead pipe, the tuning slide, which is adjustable so that you can tune your instrument. Then you have your valves numbered one, two, three, going from the mouthpiece towards the bow. It's very important to remember that the numbers are one, two, and three. Then you also have your bell and your two water keys. The water keys are important. They help release moisture from the instrument, which accumulates while you're playing. Some accessories that you may find in your case are the tuning slide grease and the valve oil. Tuning slide grease is placed on your slides. You have four of them. First valve slide, the small second valve slide, third valve slide, and your tuning slide. It's very important that you have somebody assist you in placing this on your instrument. It does not need to be done often, and your instrument will come already greased and ready to go. Then you'll also have valve oil in your case. This you should learn how to put on on your own. You will need to do this at least once a week, sometimes more often. You'll want to go ahead and get the valve oil open, and then go to the first valve. Very important to do only one valve at a time. Untwist the cap, pull the valve out, and then go ahead and put just two drops, one to two drops, a little bit goes a long way. And then as you put the valve back into the casing, just twist it around a bit to get the oil all inside the casing. Once it's all the way in, you will feel and hear it click into place. Then you can twist the cap back on. And then you'll want to check and make sure the air is moving properly through the instrument. That will indicate that the valve is back in the correct place. Go on and do the second and third in the same manner. When you are ready to put your instrument away, you'll want to push in all slides and then release all moisture from the water keys. While you're doing this, you're going to open the water key, blow air through the instrument, and move the valves. Once you've done that, you're ready to put your instrument away. Thank you for watching and I hope you enjoy learning to play your trumpet.